What's going on guys, it's Mike for Sim Racing 604 and welcome to the third installment in my fun car track combo series. Uh, so far I've covered Assetto Corsa and Automobilista 1 and as I continue on in alphabetical order I am now on to Project Cars 2. So this car track combo actually comes to me from Chris Hay who I consider a friend in sim racing and he put me on to the Aston Martin DBR1 at Monza Classic and uh, he was insisting that it really showcases what Project Cars 2 is capable of, and I, I really agree. It takes a lot to get me to like some of the classic cars. I generally don't drive anything much before 1980, but uh, this one really, really uh, is enjoyable to me. It's a fun car to drive. The pitch and body roll is really well done. They really nailed this car, and uh, it's a very fast, very wide track and uh, just a lot of fun to throw around so I love doing hot laps here so uh, the Aston Martin DBR1 at Monza Classic is the first of my fun car track combos in Project Cars 2. And next up, not a very original pick, but something that I wanted to showcase just the same. This is the 2016 Dallara IR12 Chevrolet. This is the road setup, and we are at Long Beach. I've done this video a whole bunch of times already, but it's still my go-to if I just want to do a race in Project Cars 2 and don't want to think too much about setup and what I'm going to get into particularly. I just default to this and I never have a bad time. The AI is really well done. The cars handle fantastic. The scenery is beautiful. It's just a really nicely done uh, race scenario uh, here in Project Cars 2. So uh, the Indy cars at Long Beach, an easy pick, maybe an obvious pick, but uh, fun just the same. If you've never tried it, make sure you give this a go. It's just a great sim racing experience. Have a look. And finally guys, the fantasy of fantasies. This is sort of the ultimate car lover's dream. This is the McLaren F1 at the Azure Coast. It's an incredible drive and just takes things to another level, especially in VR. You're driving one of the rarest and most expensive and most loved cars in the world in one of the most beautiful settings in the world and it just is a fantastic experience. I highly recommend this. If you don't have VR, try it in single screen and it's still fantastic, but you get that little bit of extra. You get that real sensation of the center seat position when you're in VR and uh, all in all it just comes together beautifully. So that's going to do it for this one guys. I'll be back very shortly with another best car track combos video. Next we'll go to race room racing experience. Thank you guys for watching. Have fun with these and we will see you next time.